Hello and welcome to Fact Space. Today we're looking at five portals to other dimensions. The word portal is used to describe a place that can connect one world to another, allowing physical and non-physical beings to pass through depending on the portal's location and how it was opened. A portal can be shaped and placed in almost any way, but according to scientific beliefs and various theories, some places are more prone to housing portals than others. That's why today we'll be diving into a few hotspots for transporting our minds and bodies between realities. Number 5. Wardrobes If you're a movie or book fan, you may be able to picture where our next theory stems from. In the popular film and book franchise The Chronicles of Narnia, a wardrobe is often used to link our world to the land of Narnia. This appears to happen randomly and eventually shifts to portals opening in other places too. So, what's to say that this mythical occurrence couldn't very well exist in the real world? Wardrobes are known for their spaciousness and coupled with privacy and the ability to open and close with ease makes them a prime candidate for portals. Well, that doesn't mean that a wardrobe or closet necessarily houses another dimension inside of it, opening a portal there would be an effective way of creating a link between two worlds without it being out in the open. Number 4. Mirrors Mirrors are a type of object that are made out of glass and reflect whatever is in front of them. This works based on the way that light hits the mirror and can differ based on the shape and size of the object. Mirrors are so versatile and have a lot of different uses, meaning you'll probably use them every single day. But what if there's more to them than we think? Many people wonder what could lie beyond the surface of a mirror and whether or not they could lead to another dimension. This theory comes from many places, but often includes two mirrors facing each other to create a tunnel of never-ending reflections where other dimensions supposedly exist. Other ideas figure that, rather than directly linking our world to another, a mirror is the perfect portal that can be activated via specific rituals. While skeptics may argue that mirrors are simply a thin, reflective surface with nothing special about them, others see the potential of that reflection being something much bigger than we may realize. Number 3. Stone Structures There are two ways that a portal can exist, by being created or opened by an individual, or by opening on its own because of special circumstances. While most portals must be set up and opened to access another world, there are a few places on Earth that may do most of the hard work for us. There are many interesting rock formations around the world that occur both naturally and man-made, but Stonehenge is notably one of the most popular. The stone structure's purpose and history aren't incredibly clear, but what is clear is that the site sits above a very powerful area where 14 ley lines exist. Ley lines is the term used for how ancient grounds and monuments all seem to be connected with straight lines, and with Stonehenge at the center of so many, it's no wonder people theorize that the energies from the surrounding locations have created something potentially out of this world. While the tourist spot may not actively hold a portal at all times, creating one in this atmosphere would prove to be much more successful than other ways to get to another dimension, since this landmark is teeming with spiritual energy. Number 2. Black Holes A black hole is an area in space that has a powerful gravitational pull towards everything around it, making it impossible for anything sucked inside to escape and giving off the visual representation of a literal black hole. While black holes are still very much a mystery to humans, there is limited information to suggest that entering a black hole, depending on the size and mass of it, would effectively tear your body to shreds. That being said, there are theories that the elusive vortexes could be more than just the means to an end. They could very well be the path to another dimension. Since black holes aren't an easy thing to understand by any means, they are by far one of the biggest contenders for active portals. Perhaps the scariest thing about this theory is, when entering a black hole, escaping doesn't seem to be an option, so instead of acting as a normal back and forth portal might, a black hole portal may transport you to another dimension and never let you back out. Number 1. Dreams When you go to sleep, while you may not be consciously awake and alert, your brain continues to fire off images and sensations into your mind. This is the simple explanation of how a dream occurs often backed by random memories or things that have occupied your thoughts recently. Dreams are completely unpredictable with a range of different emotions and ideas provoking each one, meaning things can happen in your dreams that couldn't happen in real life. While the term dreams are not real is widespread, specifically when addressing nightmares, what if they are? Since dreams take you to another place outside of the world we live in, who's to say that our dreams aren't simply a portal to another dimension? This is supported by the fact that scientists still only have a vague understanding of dreaming and why our brains do it. 
So when everything powers off for the night, couldn't it be possible that our brains check in on other realities? For those of us who suffer from nightmares, this possibility is pretty frightening. But thankfully, it seems that dreams are only a window into what could be another dimension, allowing us to take a peek at how other worlds differ from ours without actually visiting or sticking around. So that leaves us with one final question. What's your other dimension like? If you're new here or haven't subscribed already, then be sure to hit the subscribe button and also the bell so you don't miss anything from Factspace.